Hello everybody, I hope you're having a great day. Well, I'm making a fried bologna sandwich. Have you ever had one of those? It's a great classic American treat. <laughs> well, let me show you how to do it. It's really easy and really delicious. Of course, you want to start with some nice thick bologna. Bologna is the way it's properly pronounced. And I'm going to go ahead and put that in a skillet that has no heat on it yet. It's a cold skillet because I want to get an onion cut up. So I'm using a red onion and very carefully I'm going to slice it in these thick slices. And you want to be careful. Make sure you don't uh, cut your fingers, of course. Just like this. It always pays to be careful when you're handling a knife. And once you get them uh, sliced, then you want to go ahead and break up the rings. And I've got a another uh, skillet warmed up and I'm going to put some butter in it about a tablespoon a tablespoon and a half of butter and we're going to start sauteing these onions I tell you what the smell of sauteing onions is outstanding and of course you want to put a little salt in there get them stirred turn them over get them coated with that butter and to that we're going to also add a little pepper if you like pepper and I do now it's time to get the heat going on the bologna. Nice, low heat. This is how you keep your bologna from curling up and you don't have to cut it to get it to stay flat. You take your time, nice and slow, give it a chance. And that pan will warm up and the bologna will start to sizzle. You can hear it. We want to keep the onions, of course, turned over. Look at that. It's getting nice and brown, and you can just get it as brown as you like it. Just let it, just let it cook until it's the way you like it. So I'm going to go ahead and let this continue to, to brown. It changes completely the taste of bologna. One last flip, and then we're going to put some cheese on. Now I happen to have three different kinds of cheese in the refrigerator, so that's what I'm using. But you use whatever kind of cheese you have. And I'm going to get some toast, toast some bread, and now put some spicy brown mustard because I think that's going to just be a great complement to those sweet onions. But you put on what you like. Maybe you'd prefer mayonnaise or something else, but it's really good with this spicy brown mustard. So we'll get that on. And now for the bologna. Three warm, delicious cheese-coated slices of bologna. Oh, this is great. One, two, and then the last one. And that's some pepper jack cheese on that last one. And now for the onions. They're nice and caramelized. Really sweet. Even if you don't normally like onions, you might like them like this. Well, let's get that sandwich put together. And, of course, we want to cut it for presentation, of course. <laughs> now, let's take a look. Oh, my goodness. That is a thing of beauty. How about some olives to go with that? Why not? Just like that. Fried bologna sandwich. A great American classic. You need to give this a try. How about a taste? Oh yeah, that's good. Hey, I appreciate you watching. I hope you give this a try. Take care. We'll see you next time. Bye now.